If you guys hear the dogs crunching on their carrots, ignore it. Same with the outside noise. It's like they had this whole time to clean up the grass and they want to do it now, right when I'm filming a video, you know? It's, it's always when I'm filming a video that people want to do things. They're like right in front of my window too. <laughs> Today I did want to make a video in regards to these little DIY lash clusters because if you guys know me, you know that I like to wear little lashes and I used to always get lash extensions but nowadays, you know, at the end, of, I don't want to be going anywhere and like, I don't know, it's just more convenient for me to do them myself. At some point from time to time, like if I go on vacation, I might get my lashes done here and there but it's not a necessity for me to do it every two weeks, you know? So, for all the girlies out there who are too lazy or not wanting to spend over $100 to get your lashes done, there's so many affordable options out there like these. So, this brand was kind enough to send them over to me and I'm really grateful because look at how cute they look. And I don't want to butcher the name, but that's what they're called. And I will, of course, be linking everything down below. They did send over lashes and they also sent over two lash glues. One of them is more so like a, a little lash glue like this. And then the other one was supposed to be like a little wand, kind of like this. This is, of course, a different brand because they, I don't know if they forgot to send them over or if they're still on their way here, but I just didn't have time to wait for them, honestly. I will be linking everything down below because, again, if you're going to get these, you might as well just get the whole pair. All of their glues are like $9.99, so what a steal. But they do have a glue and a bonder, so of course you put the lash glue before you put on your lashes and then you put the bonder after you do your lashes. They do have a bundle and you can get it for $16. So, I mean, realistically, $9.99 plus $16, that's like less than $30 right there just on getting some lashes that you can do at home and again these come with five pairs and they're so pretty and I would think a couple of weeks ago I did end up getting the Urban Doll I don't know if you guys know what the Urban Doll lashes are but they kind of look like this so little lash clusters but these are expensive like $30 I think per pair $16 something like that so you can get a better bang for your buck getting one of these versus just getting like a one pair and I'm really irritated with this brand because I ended up thinking that I ordered like different ones but I ended up getting all these petite sizes like who is a petite I am not a petite girl I mean like size wise yes I'm a little shorter but I like longer lashes, so I'm really excited to try these out, honestly, and they look really, really pretty, again. And in the back, if you're not somebody who's ever put these on, they're so easy to put on, and I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is to put them on, but yeah, it shows you the instructions in the back on what you would have to do. If you want to pause it, you're more than welcome to do so, but I'm gonna continue on with the video because I have things to do. <laughs> it is 11.30 and I have to work at 12.30, so. Thankfully, I do work from home. Which I'm really excited and I don't like looking like a mole rat if you guys can see me now I look like a mole rat. I'm giving I'm giving bald right now <laughs> All right, I am also very hungry and like The fact that I have not enough time. I'm ugh. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead <clears throat> And show you guys again once more That these do come with five five pairs like period. They're the type of lashes where you can just reuse them multiple times and then throw them away and go on to the next. Like the fact that these come with five pairs, what a steal for $9.99. I'm gonna go ahead really quickly though and curl my lashes. Where is my little mirror? I got questions on where I got this mirror last time and don't be coming at me because it's dirty, but I got this from Target. It's like the Magnolia brand. So if you guys were interested in finding out where I got that from, there you go. I think it's funny when my boyfriend asks me if this hurts. Like, no, it doesn't. I mean, it looks kind of crazy, like very psychotic, if you will. But of course, for somebody who's never used any of anything like this before. But I like to, you know, do this a couple of times just to get them nice and curly. My lashes overall, like look at that, period. <laughs> my lashes overall are like more curly, if you will. I know some people have like straightforward lashes, which I'm really sorry if you have lashes like that. I'm just kidding. Shit, as long as you have lashes, we're good. But why do boys have longer lashes than girls? Like, I look at my boyfriend's lashes, and his are not curly like mine, but they're more straightforward, and they're so long. I'm just like, how? Look at that, period. I'm literally so annoying. <laughs> okay, so yeah, now that I have curled my lashes, this is something that I always do. 
I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the lash glue. This basically you just run it through your lashes and I'll show you guys here in a second how to do so. In their bundle that they have, you get a little tweezer, you get like a lash applicator, and then you also do get a little spoolie. So definitely check that out as well. Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and apply some of this glue onto my lashes. So I like to go ahead and go in there. Not me making a mess, this always happens to me always and i go in there real good because you know what we're trying to make these last for at least a couple of days look at my mess don't just ignore it because at the end of the day you can always take that off if you do just do it this way i would recommend to put some glue on the lash itself but i'm gonna go ahead and just put some of this lash glue or i'll do the other one actually so you grab some of the lash glue and then you put it on the lash band itself i'll just put like a little dot on here and with the lash glue you have to make sure to shake it first before you decide to apply it because sometimes it'll come out watery so what i'm gonna go ahead and do i have like a little dot right here if y'all can see and i'm gonna go ahead and literally dunk this in there just a little bit you know a, a little a little dunk And again, please ignore that. We're not here to judge. Because <laughs> I'm messy. Okay, so now that that one's put in place, look at that. Go ahead and put on the other one. And again, it's the same concept, nothing to it. Oh. And I really like that the band is so skinny. Like you really can't see the band at all. If you guys can't see anything. The band is at the bottom and it's so freaking skinny. Like. I love it. Some companies, they make the lashes so thick too, it just feels like so unnatural. But I'm gonna go ahead and apply more glue. And I'm, there's no order, like literally you just start from the end. So I flipped it this way and since my eye, I just kind of shape it to the way that my eye is, you know, corresponding to the map. Does that even make sense? <laughs> apply this one on next to, like really close to the other one. And the thing that I like about lash clusters too is that they go under your, your lash. I'll of course fix this up real quick later once I'm done with the eye. But yeah, so far so good. Let's move on to the next one. This one is kind of like two of them together. So you'll see when I put it on. I don't think I've applied lash glue on these. So I'm gonna go ahead with this one, the, the lash glue that's kind of like a wand. And I'm going to apply some of this on the lash. I don't like to put too much lash glue either because the more you put on, the more it's going to stay on forever. So like the lash glue that they provide, I'm sure it works wonders. I did see the reviews and people like it. Um, I mean, if you're always skeptical for something, you can look at the reviews on Amazon. But for the most part, for lashes, I feel like they do get pretty good reviews, at least with this brand. So we're, if you can see, I have one more to go, but this one comes in like a bundle. So what I'm going to go ahead and do, because my eye is not that big, I won't actually need both of these. I'll probably take the one that's more closer to the end and just kind of cut it in half. I actually don't need the longer one. So yeah, I'll just go ahead and like cut through the middle, right through the band. And you can save the ones that you don't use, like use it for something else, like if there's another day where... <laughs> you know you want to be a little extra voluminous go for it so now that i do have this one i am going to go ahead and just leave it here real quick because i do have to apply more glue onto the the end part i don't think i've applied any glue on there so i'm just going to go ahead and apply some glue on the end of my lashes this is kind of giving mascara a low key like they're <laughs> it's really making my lashes long but let's go ahead Ooh. All right, so now we got the final one. So this is literally the last one that goes on the end. I could have low-key applied the 
other one on there, but I think it looks fine the way that it is right now. Okay, so I do, I don't know what happened here. I just made a mess, even worse now. <laughs> but I did finish this eye. I'm gonna go ahead and finish the other one off camera. I, I really like them. Again, they're super thin. It's not like they're too heavy or anything like that, but I really like them. I just have to get rid of that, that mess that we've got going on. But I will be right back with you guys. All right, so I did go ahead and finish the lashes and it took me a little bit just because it didn't want to stick on, but it's sticked on now, it's stuck. And it's not going anywhere and i really do like them i think they're very voluminous so if you're somebody who likes the volume you love the drama definitely would recommend to get these and realistically speaking you don't have to use all of them either like if you want to just use these for like the ends or they're really pretty though i really like them kind of do wish it could it came with like littler ones that you can put right here you are getting five pairs in here and you can literally reuse them it's not like you know you use them once and then you gotta throw them away no you can probably reuse this a couple of times before you use a new pair and i will definitely be linking all of this down below for you guys they do have different ones that you can get so these are not the only ones that they have available because yeah aside from like lash clusters they do also have skinnier ones too and let me see here i'm gonna definitely look into the other ones that they have because i'm actually really interested these were already like curated. So these are already made to, you know, you can put them on just like this. I know there are some lashes where these are other ones that they do have. And I kind of prefer these better. Um, again, not to say that there's anything wrong with these. These are really pretty and I really like them. And I feel like they're just giving volume. I like to wear longer lashes. So that's just me. But these, the ones that I just showed you guys, they kind of are more customizable. So if you want to you know play with the different sizes you know this is kind of what they're giving and i will if you guys want i can do a review on these i'll buy them myself and try them out and see how they are but yeah if you do want to do for like the urban doll lashes definitely get these they do have different ones that are more natural they do also have these that are you know definitely they're giving volume is what they're giving so if you you know want to find some nice lashes for your birthday or if you're going on vacation i would definitely recommend these they're giving what they're supposed to give i think at least um but yeah if you guys did enjoy this video give it a thumbs up comment down below or you know let me know if you are interested in seeing more of these lash type of videos because they are definitely very fun and i always enjoy trying out new lashes especially when they can become staples in your kit but yeah, it does wrap up today's video. I do want to thank you guys for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.